Yeah, it's a great question. Uh, Discovery Overnight Camp is kind of our take on like classic residential summer camp. Um, we're a little bit different from a lot of camps where we don't do everything here. Um, and the way we're, that we're really set up is to get outdoors and get out on trail, uh, whether it's backpacking or challenge hikes or rafting the Arkansas River. Uh, it's kind of all of the things that we love about summer camp from s'mores and goofy songs and skits mixed with uh, this kind of more adventure outdoor component. Here at Discovery Overnight, each week is themed with a different science curriculum. Um, those can include geology, water ecology, or animal adaptations. So our usual schedule for Discovery, a week of Discovery, is uh, when campers come about midday, Monday, do some welcome games, kind of get to know camp a little bit better, get to know some friends while they're here. And then at the end of the night, after we have dinner, we have a really, really fun campfire that's hosted by all of our amazing counselors here. Then Monday nights will end with some astronomy, uh, which is optional for campers who want to stay up a bit later. But we do have a really cool telescope here where we're able to see some really cool things in the night sky. Tuesday, campers are going to head out on their backpacking overnight. So they're going to pack up all the things that they need for the next 24 hours into a backpack. And they're going to head out into the wilderness um, for a one night backpacking trip on some of our local trails here in Summit County. They're learning some of those outdoor living skills. They're learning how to set up tents. They're learning why do we set up tents in a certain area, they're learning how to pump water safely. On Wednesday, when our campers return from their wilderness overnight trips, they are having lunch and heading back out into Summit County where they're going to be playing all sorts of games for their mega camper choice activities. Thursday looks pretty different, but super, super fun. I think Thursday is my favorite day at camp. Uh, the night prior, the campers get to choose what kind of challenge hike they'd like to go on on Thursday. You wake up really, really early, uh, and that ranges from places like uh, Lake Trail all the way up to crushing some peaks up here, like uh, Peak One, Buffalo, Quandary. Um, so we have like even 14 years offered for those campers that want that challenge. On Fridays, our campers are going out on their adventure days. That might include rafting, rock climbing, a ropes course, or even horseback riding. And once they come back, we gather around a campfire once again to do our closing celebration. Uh, while campers are at Discovery Camp, uh, they might get lucky and see the HPG or the hot pink gorilla. Uh, this is an extremely rare sighting. Uh, so while campers are here, they definitely need to keep their eyes peeled and be on the lookout. Discovery Overnight Camp is at the Keystone Science School, uh, although a lot of Discovery Camp happens off of these 23 acres. There are two types of sleeping accommodations for our Discovery Overnight program. We have our Bighorn or Henry dorms, and we also have our canvas tents located down by the Snake River. Disco Overnight is for anybody from first grade through eighth grade. Any camper that's uh, that's in, within that age bracket, um, you know, our staff go through pretty extensive staff training to be able to support any type of camper, whether this is your first time spending the night away from home uh, or you've been coming for years. We also have scholarships available for those with financial need. If you would like to hear more information about Keystone Science School or Discovery Overnight, please visit us at keystonesciencesschool.org.